Well, let me ask you this then. Have you ever been a part of a team where you just felt like everything was going wrong? Like we were commenting, um, especially for that particular line. They, all, they, they were the most dynamic line for the Toronto Maple Leafs last year, putting up the most points, uh-huh. you know, five on five and career years for Tavares, Hyman and Marner. But they start the season, no Hyman. Then Tavares goes down. Now Tavares has returned. Uh, Hyman is getting set to return tomorrow. Now Mitch is gone. It just feels like even for that trio, have you ever felt like, how can we just get our bearings here? How can we just get some consistency here? It's like it's like one bad news after another. Well, <laughs> excuse me, Andy. I think that you can't feel sorry for them because there's one team I'm going to go to, and that's the Boston Bruins of last year. I think they had McAvoy, they had Chara, they had Bergeron. Um, it might have been Krejci, and there were some other guys that were out of that lineup, and they just said, you know what, we're not going to let this. So there's two options. Mm-hmm. You either say, nah, this wasn't our year, and but that, what does that mean? Like you're, you're going to miss the playoffs, and it's just like, well, we'll go get him next year? I don't think so. I think Kyle Dubas said it. He's like, we want to be like Boston, where if we have guys injured, we're confident in the other guys that can step in and do the job. So, you know what? Guys get injured. It's the National Hockey League. I mean, you got to have – you got to step up and get the job done. I think at the beginning of the year, everyone agreed that they were kind of a top 10 team in the NHL. So just because guys get hurt, you don't just say, well, you know, that's really tough. <laughs> Never had luck like this. We're going to mail it in. So you, you don't have that option. Boston didn't do it. If that's the team you want to be or want to get to, then you got to do what they did.